WCAG Criteria Implementation for K-12 Publishers by Learnetic. What is WCAG and why, as a K-12 publisher, should you be interested in adapting your materials to all learners? WCAG is a list of recommendations explaining how to make web content more accessible to people with disabilities. Did you know that, according to a World Health Organization report, there are over 1 billion people with disabilities in the world? That equates to roughly 15% of the total global population. By implementing WCAG principles, not only 85%, but 100% of the world's population will be able to fully benefit from the materials you publish. What you should pay attention to do is adding improvements to your materials that fit into the basic principles of WCAG, which are perceivable, operable, understandable, robust. Firstly, there is perceivable. Make sure that you provide text alternatives for any non-text content, so that it can flexibly change into other forms that people need, such as larger font size, a written or spoken description, symbols or simpler language. A single seed called acorn encased in a tough outer shell. Provide alternatives for time-based media like captions and audio descriptions for all video and photo content. If you look around, you will see that all that surrounds you is nature. A man climbing up a hill with a backpack on his shoulders. Make it easier for users to see and hear your content, including separating the foreground from the background. Remember that your digital content should be also responsive so it can be presented accordingly to the used device without losing information or structure. Your content should also be operable. Make sure that all the functionality of your product can be used only with a keyboard, that is, without needing to use a mouse or pointing device as well. Use simple and logical key combinations for easy page navigation like in this example. Give users enough time to read and use the content for any moving, blinking or scrolling information. Make sure to design content in a way that does not cause seizures or physical reactions. Instead of flashing images or text, the content can be attractively presented by gently changing the colours or brightness. Create different variations of the same exercise. Prepare your materials without the need to write an answer. It should be enough to mark a response with a pointer. Be mindful of users who are browsing through your e-content. Allow them to easily navigate, find relevant parts of the materials and quickly determine where they are. Do not forget that the user interface, navigation and final content must be understandable. Remember to make text content readable by delivering materials in the user's native language. Try not to confuse users when they are answering questions. Provide clear answers and an uncomplicated process of giving them. Prepare your e-content in a well-organized and structured way to help users navigate between modules. To make your e-content robust, take care to maximize its compatibility with current and future extensions and supporting applications including assistive technologies. Make sure that your content is well-formed so that it can be presented seamlessly by browsers and other user agents like screen readers. Now you know all basic information about creating WCAG-compliant educational interactive content. To learn more, visit our website. We have the right tools and the knowledge of how to create WCAG-compliant educational resources.